at probably an event that's just ended uh, for you guys. But for me, it's, it's still here. And that is the Clever Girl. Yeah, that's what we're going to have to call it now. Not the big one. Not the one it should be called. Clever Girl. Uh, also, I just wanted to uh, highlight something I mentioned in my last video. That I went off to Dot Toro and it wasn't there. When you guys pointed out that actually Toro... It was picking up that, the you know, in the event uh, supply drops, there was a Toro that you could dot three of that event. And the tracker was picking up as if there was a Toro there. But when I got there, there was no Toro because I'd already dotted my maximum of three. Which in hindsight makes sense. But right then I was like, why was going on? But... This isn't the only glitch I've had with Toro recently. Uh, I'll put up a video now uh, where I ended up um, no, being nowhere near, just like a regular dinosaur on a map, and it, it appeared. And it was right next to another Toro. Um, I've had it where, you know, you think that might be a glitch. Well, there was a Toro there. I've had it where Toro's popped up far away, and it hasn't shown that Toro was there in a little, like, this is with that. So... Not too sure what's going on with Toro. I think because they put Toro in a an event, like the supply event, then it's messed up with the code. <laughs> so now Toro might just show up in the wild. I don't know. Let me know if I'm the only one that's having this issue in the comments down below. Uh, you guys are the, the fastest way that I can verify whether things are just happening to me or if it's a like an event-wide thing or problem. In this case, it's a good thing because being able to dot Toro, I mean, the most you can dot an Omega is 120 or around about thereabouts. Let's, we'll say for argument's sake, if you got a direct hit and you had 15, you probably could get 160, I think is the max you can get. So what's new with your game then, James? Hey, let's have a look. So uh, another funny glitch is that you get thrown to the emotes screen instead of looking at your dinosaurs, which is a bit of a bit of annoying, I'll say. Uh, and I, <laughs> I was having a look through emotes because I never normally look at my emotes. And I just decided to use the most irrelevant emotes you could ever have. Eggs makes no sense whatsoever. Uh, the 30th anniversary makes no sense. The gates makes no sense. Uh, technically, the glass doesn't make any sense. I mean, if there's some bigs coming, I suppose. And the volcano is just rage. But there's, there's loads, especially a dot one, like, missing. We never dot with multiplayer. <laughs> so you can't be like, hey, you missed with it. It's like, oh. Uh, maybe, I guess you could use a miss, but there, there's a lot of emotes in here that I have that make literally no sense. Well, I've just done it today, and I finally can get my Tyranno Valkyrie up to level 30. Now, this is a dinosaur that, oh, sorry, flag reptile hybrid thing that anyone can use. I think it's it's good against flocks. It's good against cloak sort of things. It's good against armor. It's a, it's an all around good dinosaur. And I finally have half a million coin. And in order to level this up, it costs a quarter of a million coin. So all the coin I've saved up, gone. Or like a lot of it, half of it gone. So we will, of course, because we get loads more health, 339 health, and 128 extra attack. And not only, hey, Skyscraper, I got 25 boost for that. I also have one more boost I can add to it, and I may as well just add extra attack. So that's hopefully really going to help me. Again, I think I'm in New Blush Horse. I am just... <laughs> I'm, I'm barely clinging on. The thing we want to do and check out today is Isla Event, because... As far as I'm aware, you know, apart from doing the glitch where you do a, a raid with somebody who has that creature, then you can put it into your tracking system. This is the, the only way to get it, uh, and the fastest way. Once you've got it unlocked and you can track it, then it will start appearing on the map, I think. We're gonna try and get all the way to the top, because at the very tippity top is 140. That is way more than you will ever be able to dart because it's a raptor and they're tiny and they're unforgiving. Most of the time when you just miss the direct hit, it costs you half the amount of DNA. So if you normally get a 26 on a common, you might get 14 or something like that. But if you just miss a slight bit, you, you get eight instead of 12. Like 12's a direct hit, it makes no sense. I really think they've been super stingy with these uh, Omegas. Maybe they are. Maybe they will be powerful when they're fully leveled up, but let's have a look at our roster. We do have a, we have, well, we have a couple of dinos that can regain health. We've got the Monostegatops that has the dig in. We've also got this thing. Uh, yeah, the refresh, the Tyranno Str uh, Stronic. So if you have that already maxed up, that's really gonna help you. Um, 
You've got this guy. You've got the um, Ankylosaurus Lux, which is, you know, it can't really heal itself, but it's pretty decent. Um, I'm just wondering whether it's best. Or oh, you've also got the um, Stego, whatever it is, this thing. Although it's technically only level four. So, yeah, I mean, it is level four. It doesn't auto uh, change. There's a lot of dinosaurs here. I could probably level up a little bit at the same time. You know what? We'll, we'll go into here. I will level up the uh, Styracosaurus Lux because I think that's a dinosaur. I think it was in it. Wasn't it level 25? Why did it say I could evolve it? Yeah, it says I've... Oh, it's hell. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid James, get it together. All right, okay. Miragaya can actually heal, which is pretty decent. Uh, we can put Miragaya in, I suppose. Monostegatops. Add to team. And Ceratosaur is another one that we can add to team. I don't know. Oh, sorry. We could evolve, I guess. I'm trying to think. Eh, we'll see. Uh, let's use Miragaya first. Miragaya is an interesting one. Maybe we can get by with the first level only using Miragaya. That would be pretty deep. Uh, pretty neat. Pretty deep? Oh, that's something that's in... Suntan lotion? Is it? Deep? I don't know. Anyway, there you go. Uh, he's... Oh, he's got defense shatterings. That's never any good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's also not very good. Uh, he could go for... Oh, and then he gets a... Oh, oh that's going to do a lot of damage if he does it. But we slow him down. Oh, no, we don't. Is he immune to... He's immune to slow down. Okay. Here it comes. 50% chance. Gets it. And oh, we almost die. Boop. But is it possible? Oh, we are going to kill it. Look at that. Bam. Right. So we have our refresh, which is very, very good. Uh, ah, you can't do anything to me. <laughs> Right, we'll go for this. I mean, he could nullify, I suppose. But we do get a lot of help there. The distraction comes through. Never mind. That was a lot of damage. That was a lot of damage. <laughs> uh, is it immune to stun? No, it's not. Mono Stegatops. Off you go, son. And voila. There we go. That's what we want to see. Get the stun off. I mean, then it would be its turn, so it's no more stun. Um... I guess we could go for nullifying? Oh, sorry, digging. You know what? We'll go for digging. If Even if it goes for nullify... Oh, actually, yeah, there was no point in me really doing that. I'm going to take a hit either way. Oh, or distraction. Distraction's good, I suppose. Uh, we could go for stun now. Do we get the stun? Yes, we do. Fantastic. And we still have that going. Do we have enough to kill it in one? Yes, we do. There we go. I wanted to get the, the dig in to refresh. Remember, these events are all about, you know, just, just trying to save <laughs> uh, whatever health you can. Um, oh, this guy is kind of deadly. Um, he has this fierce impact, which we could prepare for. Hmm. Or we could dig in. You know what it is? I'm gonna go for this guy. Swapping resilient. Yeah! Yeah, we got Mono Stegatops. We've got Styracosaurus Lux. I think both of them have their own versions of Dig In. And we can just swap between. I think that's probably the best bet. Vulnerable. And he'll go. Oh, he did. Oh, oh he gets a crit. Of course, he gets a 5% chance to get a crit there. Great. Uh, we could heal. Um, I think that's probably what I'm gonna do. I think maybe switching between Monostegatops and Styracosaurus Lux is, is probably the best thing. Because he'll go for his biggest one. <sighs> Don't get a crit this one, though. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Lucky! Uh, we could kill him if we wanted to. I think that's probably, the, that's probably the safest bet. We'll just... We'll complete this one and we'll write it off as a learning experience. <laughs> Woo! the most amount of health. But again, it can heal that right away. I think we need 200. Oh, it's 100 for a clever girl. There it is. We will, I assume, fingers crossed if I'm not an idiot, uh, be able to unlock it. So we've got Deodocris. We've got the, uh, what's it called? The Scolosaurus. The only one that can go through. Oh no, none of them can go through armor. Fantastic. So this is like a staller team. Um, really, I guess going with Miragaya first... 
Um, seeing if I can... I mean, there's a swap in with you. I don't... Oh, you're just a piercer. That could be good, though. None of these uh, stop you from swapping. So having something that can swap in, do damage. I think Ankylosaur stuns when it swaps in. Yee, invincibility on escape. It does stun and swap in. Okay, so Ankylosaur looks might be another good one. Because that is level 30. It does have so much attack and boosts on it. Uh, if it goes below half health, it's not too bad either. Because I guess it could get its invincibility up. Um, I will start with Miragaya. Um, Scolosaurus is one that doesn't have too much uh, attack straight away. So we're going to heal. Oh! Oh, please tell me you don't attack me when you swap in. Oh, it's a Counter-Strike! This is great! This is great! Is it me to stun? Yeah, it's not! Okay, this could go... It could go either way. We'll see. We'll see. So we get our health back on the Miragaya. Yes! And now... Fate's in uh, Destiny's hand here. I'm going to go for the Styracus... Oh, no. I have armor, though, right? Right? Okay. Okay, it's good. It's good. It's good, I think. I thought Styracosaurus looks had a stun. We might... Oh, we lost it. We've lost it. I'm an idiot. Oh, dear. <laughs> ah! Well then, that's always good. <laughs> Lost it right away. Oh, what am I like? Taunting defense? So you increase your defense to 50%. Get a shield as well. Ooh. I mean, you do have a counter, but it doesn't go through armor. And I get a shield as well. Or maybe it oh, reduces armor. But you have so much attack anyway. Okay, okay. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll. Oh, you're swapping out. This could be good, because Miragaya, I might be able to get even more health back. Invincible, what? Oh, it's Scholar. I can't believe I lost Derekosaurus on Battle 2. <laughs> Idiot! My God! Why did you watch this channel? <laughs> For that, it's content. Can you do it? Losing Styracosaurus. I mean, it'd be amazing. Uh, I'm going to go for this. Oh. You know what? Happy with that. Happy with that. Because, again, apart from putting up a shield and maybe doing 2,000 damage, I suppose, as long as I have my shield up, I'm good. I feel like it wanted me to switch. <laughs> okay, it survived. Does that have a counter? No, it doesn't. Okay, switch again. Yes! This is what we needed! Damn it! We should have... Now I wish I had my Styracosaurus looks. I would have healed and then done a massive hit. Oh. Right. Then we were supposed to do this. Then we were supposed to do this. Oh, he's not swapping out this time, though. Okay, hopefully we get the stun, bypass the armor, monostegatops. Again, if I had the coin, I might now just, you know, level up monostegatops. Because the hybrid I think it has, um, I've already used. So I don't think I need it technically. Um, any more of its DNA. Unless, you know, uh, of course, another hybrid could always come out. But in this, right now, Monostegatops. I think you only need level 20 for the hybrid if it if it does have one. I don't even know if it does. Uh, we'll go for the stun. And what we could do is swap it. Oh, yes. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I, you know what? I could have just swapped in Miragaya, gone for heal. And in fact, actually, that's what I will do. Um, unfortunately, I do my vulnerability. Oh! Oh my goodness! <laughs> that was with vulnerability. That's what that was. <laughs> oh, dear. You've got good, you know, good utility, but... Ah, my God. Uh, okay, Miragaya... Can you come in, uh, take a hit, heal, and then we'll swap Monostegatops in. You've got all the health. Oh, even better. I think that probably runs out after two turns, right? Yes, that's great. Okay, so it's faster, and it could probably go for 2,100. Okay, okay, yep, yep, you, you do that, you do that, you do you. I mean, if you got a crit, I think I would still survive. So we reduce its speed. We do an attack. Then we'll heal. Then we'll get out of here. And then we'll have Monostegatops come in. 
So at this point, very, very brittle. I just don't have a good attacker. I don't have like a Mortem Rex ready to go and just kill things, unfortunately. So, I mean, we lost a fair amount of health. Um, and then we can just, we, I mean, we can just finish this off, right? Unless it swaps in, which it might do. We'll see, we'll see if it swaps out. No, it doesn't, okay. So then the, what's it called? The scoreless. Oh, you know what? Ah, there's so many different tactics you could go for here. Like, if you just had something weak left, like this thing, you could time your switch ins and gain health and then swap out and then gain health. And I think that's what you probably want to do. So, 800, and then I lose. Oh, a crit, really? Come on, 5%. I've been so unlucky with those. Um, and then we'll just put in. Ang oh. Oh, I forgot he was a thing. Okay. Okay, well, hopefully we stun him and he doesn't get off his counter to swap in and heal. <laughs> yes. There we go. That's good. Uh, might as well just put this up. There's nothing he can do. And, oh, if only. If only I could get another dig in with mono stegotops. And Skullosaurus comes in now and uh, it's dead. It's just, it, I don't think it matters what we do here. It, it, it can't survive. Boom. There we go. Level two. Complete. We lost Terrakosaurus Lux, though. <laughs> I'm just so good at this game. All right, okay. Level three. Only. Is there 10 of this? Yeah, that must be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. All right, okay. Oh, a boss already? You're giving me a boss opponent. What? What? Refresh? Does it refresh the team? Heal. No, doesn't. Uh, is there anything that can give, like, a... Uh, good things? Priority heal, least HP, teammate. Teammate, cleanse and heal. So is that for everyone? Does Muragaya heal everybody? It says teammate, cleanse and heal, this much. So Muragaya could be a good one to heal everything. But then Muragaya is a glass cannon. Um, what could Styracosaurus Lux do? Self, target, target. Ah, what is blue weak to? It has a resistance to bleed. Uh, pretty much everything. Okay. This is really, really not good. Uh, <laughs> does it kind of attack Flox? Cle clever dodge. Okay, all opponents. Okay, cleanse and group cunning strike hits all opponents as well. Oh my god. This is not good. It has priorities. Right off the bat, it can go out of the blue and just go for 2,400 damage and kill everything. 135 speed. It's pretty much faster than everything. Um... This event is broken! Are you kidding me? I'm a, I'm a person that's played this game since launch. And I'm not going to be able to get past number 3 out of 10. Are you ridiculous? It's literally a paywall! Pay! Oh my god! Like, this just seems so... 31,000 health. Bear that in mind. 31,000 health. Um... I mean, increase attack? Does it have armor? No. Gorgosuchis? I mean, if I put in Miragaya, Monostegatops, and it goes for out of the blue, because I, I don't know if it hits everybody. Target. Target all opponent. Target at random, though. Unless we had somebody who has a, a priority and... No. I don't know, man. A prowl. There's no taunting. And maybe... <laughs> taunting shield rampage? He's gonna die though in one. Oh, okay, okay. Let's just see. Let's put the best in. And close looks. Mirror Gaia. Uh, let's put in Intimidate. Hmm. Let's put in Mono Stegatops. Add to team. The best I've got. Level three. Can we do it? Normally, the boss is at the end. Or at least maybe battle eight. But right now. I mean, it is just blue. Do we get to see what blue does straight away? Oh, okay, so it just cleanses itself and gets a dodge. Right. Okay, so we'll give everyone extra attack. 
And then everybody else can put up shields. Shields. Oh, I should... You know what I should have done? I should have done a, uh, a team just to scout out. Like a really weak team. Okay. Um, I could go for a shield here and then heal next turn. Okay. Okay, here we go. Confirm. This is what I'm doing. I don't think it attacks me. Clever dodge. Yep, dodge. Critical increase chance. Yes! Okay, everyone else is gonna get shields now. Yes! Okay, I don't think it has something to take away shields. Ooh. Ooh, and then next turn, everyone's gonna have extra attack. Oh, maybe they should have healed next turn. No, he, he's got his priority, so he would just hit me. If I had a speed increase, that would be pretty cool. So... Wow. Re oh, remove dodge! Ah! And close look! Showing why we have it. Nice. Okay. 5,000. Good. Oh, everyone gets a shield! <gasps> oh, and I've got taunt. Oh, this is fantastic! Uh, I don't think... I think the boss is probably going to be immune to stun. Could you imagine if you did stun it yet? Uh... Reduces attack. Uh, who's this? Gorgosuchus. I guess just go for a... I mean, maybe cleanse yourself? Maybe? Just in case you have reduced speed and attack? Because it... I mean, I know it's taunt, so it will go for Ankylos Lux. So just go for a big hit. Ankylos Lux. I don't think outspeeds it. So we may as well slow it down and give it an invulnerability. Oh, vulnerability. And then Miragaya just go for the shield. Let's see. Let's see. I thought this was a paywall. Maybe it is. We'll find out. Okay. So it should... It, oh, does it hit everybody? Oh, and it got a crit. So even if Ankylos Lux had taunt, it didn't go for it. Thank God I had the... Uh, oh, did... Wait, did it hit everybody? Oh, it slowed down everybody, but it only hit one of them. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, maybe I should have cleansed then. <laughs> okay, okay. Can we slow him down a little bit? I just want to reduce attack and reduce uh, speed a little bit. Um, and if he's got any attack, maybe... Oh, no, it doesn't reduce it. Okay, here we go. Distraction. There it is. Lower the attack. And yes, of course... I think it's immune to attack lowering, though, now that I think about it. But it's definitely slowed down. Mono Stegotops. Oh, my God. You got this. Come on. Come on, dude. Uh, cleanse. I mean, priority? What's it, what's it going to go for? Oh, is this just reduce everything? Oh, no. It's going to attack something. It's going to attack everybody. Does this give a shield to everybody? It's just self. It's just self. Uh, I guess. Uh, distract it. No, there's no point because it's immune to distraction, right? I have to double check. Yes. So maybe slow it down. And shield. I don't know. I don't know. Just got to attempt it. The good thing is, even if I fail this, I can take all that I've learned and spend 300 bucks and attempt it again. And 300 bucks for the amount of DNA you get if you do get further is worth it, in my opinion. Cleansing impact. It's our last chance to really kill it before it does anything else, but we, that was not going to happen. Oh, now you take it on board. Thank you. Now you take the taunt on board. Please just hit him. Oh my god, it's about to stick it up. You got this, buddy. <laughs> oh. Okay, we're gonna slow it down, right? Just slow it down. Yes, okay. So now everything... Monostegatops dig in. Miragaya heal again. Okay, this is alright. This is okay. I think we got this. Right. There it is. And there's no counter. Everything. It's it's time to heal another slowdown from Miragaya. So surely Blue has like no speed at this point. And now it's all about uh, if any if we had like an overall cleanse for everybody, maybe Tristonix does have a heal or a cleanse everything. I don't know if it does though. Uh, it's not gonna do much. Dig in, yes. Um, the swap could be good, but I'll go. I'll give everyone a shield and then a heal from you, and just confirm. So he's gonna go for a massive attack, 
on something with the lowest health, which is probably Monostegatops. And even with the shield, Big Monostegatops is dead. Yeah. It's gonna do... I think it's killed it. What's its attack? 2,400? Yeah, I think it has... Oh! Oh, Mirakaya! Uh-oh. Then you might die, Mirakaya. I didn't realize it was lowest health. Okay. I mean... Oh, no. I've got a Torton again. Yes! It's gonna hit at close lugs, I think. Oh, no. It didn't do it last time. <laughs> yes. Okay. Oh, yes. The 700 damage. Oh, my God. I thought this was almost impossible. But it's worked out in my favor. I don't know how. Uh, go for your evasive. Yes! Evasive is fantastic. Um, and, yep. Yep. Um, I mean, that goes through dodge. And then what's the last one? It goes through dodge as well. I think we've killed it. I think we've killed it. Maybe even with the dodge, it counts as an attack. So Anklos Lux will do a counter for it. We'll see. I don't know if it does, though. Okay. Okay. I think we've killed it. Anklos Lux attack going through and Mirror Guy's attack going through. It's not much, but I think it's enough, especially since its attack boosted from the Gorgo. God, it better... The next battle better be, like, a recover so I can just have something that doesn't hit me much and I can just go dig in and stuff. That's what I want, okay? And... Yes, there we go! <laughs> hey, Mirigaya and Monostegatops gained loads of health! Anglos looks, unfortunately, took damage and so did Gorgo. <sighs> I need a fan. Oh. Okay, level four. Here we go. So, unfortunately, even if I do this, I'm 10 off. If it was 40, perfect. We have Indominus Rex, which, I mean, we know what Indominus Rex does. We really need Anklos Lux out for this because that cloak can do a lot of damage. And unless he goes for the first hit, I, which I don't think he will, he'll probably go for the cloak. Ah, it's not going to do much. Uh, okay. And then the Quetzal, which I've never really faced. It can also heal itself. It can go through a cloak. And it's got to swap in heal. Right. Okay, let's enter. Um, I have not used Ceratosaurus yet. I can evolve it? Uh, is there anything else I can evolve? I mean, I can try Stornix. I can evolve Monostegatops. Oh. Ah. It's a tricky one. Mirigai is pretty decent since it slows down. And Indominus Rex isn't immune. Oh, no, it is immune to slow down. Okay. I think there's got to be an Anklo Lux with having that Monostegatops to swap in and uh, do you have a healy intimidate no but you would have been good in the battle cleanse and you give oh you just do yourself okay marigaya and you have a swap in as well you do armor piercing damage you you know what i'll give you a go it's only going to be Anklos Lux that's going to take damage here. It's not going to heal. I need to save it for the boss. And then Mirigai can come in and go, heal! So Mirigai needs to survive. Um, we'll do Anklos Lux in first. In case that Indominus Rex comes out. <laughs> I knew it! Okay, okay. You can swap in if you want. And there it is! He's dead. You'll probably swap out. So remove that cloak. Get him vulnerable and then do this massive hit. Which is gonna do loads. Almost kills him. Almost kills him. Okay. Oh, swap out. I think the only things that swap in to do things is Quetta that can heal. Maybe the Scaffotator though. But we get invincibility anyway. Oh, to swap in bleed. <gasps> no, that's like that's Akos looks his weakness. I can't cleanse myself. Okay, okay, that's gonna do a lot, I feel. Oh, no, it takes me below half health. Okay, I gotta get out. I gotta get out now. Um, I mean, if I swap out, does he do anything? No. And he has no armor. And I do 822. So... Yeah. Makes no difference. He dies, whether I do the... Oh, no! 
Oh wait, yeah. I was like, if I did the swap out, I was locked in, but I wasn't actually. <laughs> my poor at close looks just got absolutely wrecked by bleed. That's not fair. All right, resilient rampage to swap. But you know what? I'm just going to get my Heelys so I can get out if I need to. I might swap in Anklos Lux here, depending on what it does. And the good news is we killed that thing. So there's no need to worry. Right, right. Uh, are you immune to... You're immune to stun. What can you do? I mean, the resilient rampage and run is pretty deadly. But I'll get Anklos Lux in here because it, it might stun it. And I also get a shield anyway. Oh, that's so, new. so good. <laughs> yes. Right, okay. Cool. All right, I mean, you gave yourself a shield. All right, I suppose. That's a lot of damage, though. It's a lot of damage, buddy. Uh, you still got your shield. Please, please don't go for Fierce Devour. That's going to do a number on me. And I'd hate you if you did it. <laughs> Damn it! Ah! Ah, okay. Anklosox needs to wait in the wings now. It needs to wait in the wings or else it's, uh, it needs to wait for Miragaya. Get a boss battle. Miragaya, heal. Get it healed. Right, and then it doesn't matter what you do. You can go for your cloak, but you... Yeah, okay, it doesn't probably want to finish me there. So, like I predicted, I predicted, and close looks, takes the brunt of that, unfortunately. Monostegatops actually gained health, now to full health, which is great. Oh, uh, but Anglos looks really has no way of recovering the health. And it depends what we're up against here. Um, okay, okay. The Patchy. Right. Uh, the Lambio. Perfect. And the Mono. Uh, has a dig in. Has, I mean, it's level 25, so it's it's pretty deadly. Um, I'm kind of tempted just to maybe throw in some other random dinos. Do you have a delay on this? You do have a delay. Alert instant shield, you do. Okay, you have a lot of health, though. And nothing can break your shield. If I got invincibility up, I'm good. And... I think I'm safe. Honestly, I think Anklos Lux might be able to stay in and do this because it's faster than most things. I get a shield off and I can do a lot of damage. Um, I will keep in the uh, Monostegatops because it can swap in, stun, and then dig in and get out. Swap in, stun, dig in, get out. I like that. <laughs> All right, okay. Uh, try Stonix, why not? Because it can heal itself. And I'll put Serato in there. I mean, hmm. Maybe not. Maybe I want Miragaya in here in case we come up against this thing. And all it can really do is maybe do a hit and then heal itself. No, Miragaya and, Miragaya is, and, Kyl and Kylosaur Lux is only saving grace. So we're going to start with Anklos Lux. Do one hit. And I don't think anything can swap in and do damage. I'm hoping. I'm hoping that the Mon Rhino can't. But even if it does... No, I'm a theorem. No, it can't. Okay. Okay, that's not what I wanted to happen. I did not want it to go for first, because then it could kill me. Thank you, game. Thank you. Uh, try Stonix, then. <laughs> that's, that's the worst. It's the only one that was faster than me, I think. Oh, persistent, ferocious strike. Oh, that's fant. Now he's got even more. That's horrible. Why would you do that? I mean, I'm a... Chances are he's going to go for a dig in. So I might as well just... Oh, sorry. Go for a big hit. So I might as well just do this. There you go. And then go for your big hit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well done, Try Stonex. If only you were level 30 and had boosts on. <laughs> then you might have still a chance. Okay, so now at this point, he can't really do anything. I mean... Right? All he could go for is his regular attack that I think might give him extra... Attack right away gives him 50%, but then I've got 35% armor. I think I have enough to survive, even if he goes for his regular. Oh, I was hoping you'd do that. Oh, yeah, Tony Bellow, even better. That's good, that's good. I was hoping he wouldn't go for dig in, but yeah. 
out of the two, I'd rather you went for Tording Bellow. Because then I can do this, and then I can go for my priority. And I, now I'm I'm here. I'm here to stay. You go for your dig in, dude. I'm staying. I'm staying because I think I get two turns worth of invincibility. You hit me. You don't want to hit me. Because <laughs> I'm going to counter you so hard with almost 2,000 attack. Uh, yeah, I'm not swapping out. No. Oh, you might. Okay. Invincibility on escape. Double invincibility. I'll take it. I mean, I wish you would have swapped out before. Oh. I didn't realize you had a stun. Ah. Okay, but I think I'm, I've still got my invincibility, which is fantastic. Get my shield up. There's nothing you can do. Oh, it feels good. However... I mean, I hope next turn I get my... My other one? I hope it... Wait, he's not dead? Why is he not dead? 1,700... Oh. You know what? Actually, this works out. Yes, this works out. Because he can't kill me. I mean, yeah, he'll do damage. But he can't kill me. And then next turn, priority invincibility again. Okay, we've unlocked Clever Girl. Hopefully it's a boss next turn. A mirror guy can come in with a clutch and be like... Oh! Save! <laughs> I'm hoping, I'm hoping. That's my strat. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, I see. I see. I see. You, I know. I see how it is. I see how it is, yes. Get your dig in. Yep, yep, yep. But I now have invincibility for two turns. You get hit by me, it's not looking good for you. Um, go for this. Oh, come on! Are you going to do both these and then you're going to sod off? Bet you are as well, aren't you? Yeah. yeah, take that. There we go. Just hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Run. Oh, I was going to say, if he buggered off, I'd be so annoyed. So the other one is a Lambio. And Lambio. Oh, the damage. I think I'm faster than Lambio. Although I have a... Ooh. I do have shield. Now, the worst that Lambio can do to me is ferocious strike which isn't isn't nice to me um but whatever he does to me it gets halved so let's say he gets 50 percent which is 1600 he get then half that so 800 and then my armor so i think we're good i think we're good hopefully it just goes for group cleansing Oh, there we go. There we go. Definitely, definitely one. Oh, because I don't know if I... Oh, the counter, of course! I close looks surviving with this, but I, that's all I need. I just need to survive, and then mirror guy can go... Ah. There you go. Help! Really, a good strategy for a boss would be to have something that can increase all attack, and then it'll increase the attack of the healer, which means it heals more, and then it'll heal, you know, and close looks up to, like, max health. That would be... Oh, and there it is, clever girl unlocked. Yeah. Right. Okay, that's five. We're halfway. Boss, please. Boss, please. Excuse me. What? Just asking for a friend. Why is Rexy there? Why is Utah Sin Raptor there? Oh, John C. I see. <laughs> Why? Why are all these horrible things here? What am I supposed to do? I don't have my highest Axel's looks, but I close looks needs a breather. And the only way I could see to do this is to slowly whittle them down with whatever I've got. Um, whatever else I've got. And are you telling me that Rexy, with its dominant roar, its fierce devour rampage, I mean, oh, this is just, this is just... Oh, painful. Absolutely painful. Um, you know what it is? I'm just going to put things in. I'm just pushing in that I'm happy to lose. If I could just will, if I could just get through this to possibly a box, a, a box, a boss next turn, I'd be very happy. Um, uh, is there anything that has priority? Intimidate. Okay, Ceratosaurus, you get out there. Yes, against Rexy, and you'll be faster. Uh, oh, you don't have Intimidate. 
I thought you'd have had Intimidate right off the bat. Okay. So you're being hit by a lot. 2,400 right off the bat. We do have a counter, actually. I forget with Ceratosaurus. We could level Ceratosaurus up a bit as well. Oh! Oh, that's lovely! And then we do Lacerate, which is a lot of bleed damage. Ooh! Ooh! Kill it! No! It's faster. Um, and now we can do Intimidate, I guess? Uh, target. Reduce speed by 50%. Oh, that's not good. That's... Oh, we're dead. I mean, I can reduce its speed? But it's just gonna go for a hit. I might, I might as well. I'm dead. Even if I swap out, he's gonna kill me with a counter, I think. Yeah, he would've killed me. Increase my attack, increase my armor. But it come... Luckily, he didn't go for Devour. Because that could've been bad. Um... So, he went for Dominant. He can't kill a flock. And even if he swaps out, I think we get low tide? Oh, we get nothing. <laughs> Sweet. He could swap out now and it'd be fine. Uh, I mean, if that's the case, I'll just nullify whatever comes in. I knew he would do it. I knew he would do it. <sighs> okay, maybe it's not so bad. I don't think this thing has something that can um, hit everything. Nope. Nope, it doesn't. Okay. Slow it down. Oh! Rexy comes in? I think I've killed it? I haven't killed it! I should have went for Taunting Rampage! No! Uh, if he goes for his freaking... Oh, does he lock me in? He does lock me in. Oh, no, I don't think he does, actually. Escape, attack, bypassing armor... Um, oh, yes, we killed him. We killed him. Oh, big brain, big brain, big brain, big brain plays. It's what we got to do. Count of vulnerability doesn't, I mean, just, oh, 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 I didn't need to switch out to him. Right, Rexy's done. Rexy's, I'm happy. Rexy's done. Utah Sinraptor is not a pleasant thing to come up against. Um... Slow it down, but then it has... Uh, it has so much... It has so much you can do! Am I immune to stun? Why am I not immune to stun? I mean, what does the most damage? That does the most damage. Yeah, sure. I mean, we counter it. Remember, this battle was just to weaken them or try and get through. I like how the game gives me an option of a Sarko. Who has a level 30 Sarko? <laughs> Right, um, we get dodge, right? 100% chance to dodge. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Stuck the landing. Yes. And there's nothing that can just, I mean, we might get stunned and that'd be terrible if it went for priority. Exactly. Why would it go for priority? Yep. So we just got our attack reduced, but then we do a counter. Just a little bit. Just a yeah, little bit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Right. Uh, oh, if you, oh, yes, this is perfect. Right, do... I didn't realize you had two turns worth of it. Okay, we don't do anything, but then we get rid of it, I think. We get rid of the uh, reduced damage. There we go. Okay. Slow them down. Then we can swap out. Oh, we lost the Tyranno. Oh, oh, no, we did... Oh. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh! Oh, my God! What is... Oh, he just killed me! <laughs> I'm learning so much about me dinosaurs. This thing has the crazy triple strike, though. Distracting triple strike. Um, I want to be careful of this thing. It's going to go first. It can go for cunning ferocious strike. I mean, I, can I slow it? Yes, I can. And it has no priority. So yes, let's do it. Okay, you killed one. But I'm going to slow you down. We're going to make you vulnerable. And then we're going to slow you. And then... I'm going to do a big hit. And I'm just going to lose it. Because at this point, I can't heal this thing. Even if it was in a group battle and I went for a heal, it wouldn't heal it. Because you can't heal extra members back. So I'm just going to go for a massive attack. I have 5% chance to crit. If I, if I crit him, he's dead. But 5% chance.
course not. Of course not. Ah! <laughs> My baby fish, no. Right. Right, let's end you. We'll swap in beta and then we'll swap in uh, swap in the Tyranno and that's it. Well done. I did not expect this team to work. What? Oh, it's a counter. <laughs> Whoop -de -deezes. Okay, so what's this thing? Right, uh, I don't know. Like, what can it do? That, that's the tactic, right? Is to start a battle with something that's weak and can't do anything and then just heal loads. Um, it doesn't matter what we put in here because we can just swap to Mono Stegatops and it'll just kill it. Um, and yeah, there's there's no point here. We may as well just use whatever. Just use whatever. Swap to um, Mono Stegatops. As long as we don't use Mono Stegatops first. I've, I've won. Um, Mirror Gaia. There we go. This is where I've, I haven't factored in something like locks you in when you swap and kills you. No! <laughs> there we go. Okay. And a clean save. I mean, technically, you could do that. Like, it's, you, all you have to do is lose three members, right? So as long as you just have three throwaway dinosaurs and just swap in monostegatops to do hits, you're good. Uh, as long as Monostegatops doesn't die, you can keep on using it. So here we go. Battle number seven. You get 60, 60, then 140. Oh, there it is. There it is. Anklos Lux, Gorgosuchus, uh, Monostegatops just to heal loads, and then Mirror Gaia, um, who will, I think, let's have a look at its attack. Lowest HP teammate, Cleanse. So, Gorgosuchus is faster. I'll get Group Ferocity, get the attack up on everybody, and Miragaya. I should level up Miragaya, man. But I need it. I need that DNA for something. Oh, no. I thought he had like amazing Miragaya. Like a level 30 max boosts on a Miragaya. This would be amazing. <laughs> so, Brachiosaurus is slow. And I'm assuming, you know, it doesn't have many crazy attacks. Probably a lot of group hit everything. Uh, but let's see. Oh, I love when the music stops. That's my, that's my favorite thing about this game. Okay, uh, it has a shield and it's gonna hit everybody. So that, um, I mean, there's no, I might as well attack. What's it? What's it weak to? It can't have damage reduction. It can't be slowed. Great. <laughs> uh, what is its attacks actually? Boom. Okay, I want to save my shield for that. So I'm just gonna go for you, then you, and then heal. And normally, it's going to get Anklos looks up to 1,800, but we're going to get 50%. Oh, no, it's a priority. I forgot. Oh, maybe I should have saved it for next turn. I should have saved it for next turn. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, maybe this isn't so bad then. I think because Anklos looks gives everything a shield. So, I mean, 80,000 health. I mean, it was probably 90 or something. So this is three times. Oh, a crit. Three times the health. Uh, as blue. And no armor on the Brachiosaur. I always thought Brachiosaur had armor. Come on, shield on everybody, please. Please be shield on everybody. Yes! Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, and of course, the taunt. It just goes on to... Uh, and I've already got the increased attack. So I only take 360, but then... This is where it comes. Oh, he's got a shield as well. Uh, but still, it'll be a lot of damage. 1,400. Okay. Good, 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 good. Right, so in comes the boom. Anklos Lux can go for invincibility and survive it. It's going to hit everybody. Um, Gorgosuchus? Uh, okay, you're alive. That's good. Stegoceratops. Do you want to take this shot or do you want to take whatever comes after? You want, you want to... What am I doing? I've already got a shield up. <laughs> uh, you definitely want to just survive this. And can Mirigaya survive another turn? I don't know. It depends what it does. This, I mean, this this is the, the pit stop. This is where I can heal my dinos. Oh, if only I could heal something else. I shouldn't have done this. Because now I've got to wait two turns to do Mono Stegtops heal again. So here we go. I think even with the taunt, it's still going to hit everybody. So it doesn't matter. Even if the taunt is on Anklos Lux. Break the shield. 
which is good, I suppose, to do some damage. Oh, 4,000. Good showing from Gorgasuch just there. Even at level... pathetic. <laughs> Shield. Doesn't matter about taking it. Uh, speed down or whatever. And here comes the boom. No crit? That was a lot from Miragaya. A lot. Oh, no shield and 2,000 damage. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot Miragai also has it. Oh, God! 10% battery! It has to happen. You know it has to happen. Um, do we, Wait, do we not know what it's going to do? What do you mean we don't know what it's going to do? Why do we not know what it's going to do? Uh, okay, um... Cleanse, I guess? Slow down, I guess? Uh, big swap, I guess? And shield. Confirm. Ah. Okay, what's it gonna do? It's last. Or is it? Is it because the power thing came up and I'm not gonna know what it's gonna do? Hopefully, it goes for its shielded resilient strike. I'm hoping. Because if it goes for hit everything, Miragaya might be out of it. And there goes... Anklos looks as heal. Oh god, no. I do I do have my invincibility on Anklos looks, I think. Taunt, taunt, taunt. Invincibility still, so that's good. That's good. Shield again. But we got vulnerability on Miragaya. Please don't hit everybody. I won't like that. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Oh, damn. Nuts. Oh, Monostegatops might be gone as well. Because I healed at the wrong stupid time. Okay. Um, big hit. Uh, shield on everyone. Yeah. 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 He doesn't even have that. Oh, he does have that move. Monostegatops is gone as well. Mo Everyone's gone. Everyone's died. Oh, well, Mono, well, Echolos looks might hang in there and just do loads of damage, but everyone else is gone. And I got up to seven, I think. Eight and nine are 60 each, and then number 10 is 140. If I really want... Yeah, they're gone. <laughs> if I really wanted to, I probably could do this event again. Like, reset it, and knowing what's going to happen, prepare. But... For the sake of the DNA, I've already got, you know, a hundred and odd DNA. I mean, there's a lot more to get, but I think I might call it quits after I kill this Brachiosaur. Um, I mean, I've got my shield. I'll, I'll have to confirm that. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, next turn, I'll get my invincibility for two turns, and then he's just really hurting himself for two. Yeah, 360, that's the most. I mean, I've got armor on myself thing is he's got a shield and I can't get past that shield. I don't have anyone to break it. It's either I do 43,000 damage to this Bregasaur or he does 1,000 damage to me, whichever comes first. I feel as though I might get him down to 20,000 health before I die. Oh god, yes! Oh, we needed this invincibility. This is the big hit. This is the boom. This is the one that does 2,000 damage. Already that would be reduced to maybe 1,600 and then I shield it, so cut that in half to 800. But 800 out of my 1,000 health would be, yeah, I'm basically dead in like two more turns. But with this, <laughs> you might swing your neck back and forth, but I'm not gonna be hurt. <laughs> I'm still standing, standing on my four two feet. Come on then. Uh. I mean, I've got that. Do I have one more turn? Two turns. Okay, let's just go for big hits. Next turn, I'll go for the hostile glow. Then after that, the regular hit. And then if I have survived, priority again. Like I said, I think 20,000. Maybe it was doable. That would be interesting if it was actually doable with just Anklos Lux. Because we had this last time where I was taken on a Brachiosaur. And sing like one single dinosaur was able to whittle down the Brachiosaur all the way. So it's possible that this, as well, had the chance to. So I've still got invincibility. And then I'll have shield for next turn. 
Okay, you can slow me down. I just need... Hopefully he has his own... He goes for his shield attack next turn. If he goes for boom, I'm, I'm screwed. I mean, I will survive it, but... I won't last much longer. <laughs> he did 300 last time? So I could survive another three rounds, I think, of him, of me cycling. And in that case, I think I might have killed him. So I get my shield now. Don't go for boom. Perfect. That's his cycle. And again, you know, doing it a second time, you can know what the cycle of the boss is going to be. Or, you know, pretty much. You got a crit with that. You bugger you. <laughs> Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, there's probably forums and Facebook posts and stuff like that that you could probably go to to find out what the battle or what the moveset of the Brachiosaur is beforehand. So there we go. And then he'll go for boom now. And we go for, ah, uh, yep, confirm. So I thought I'd get down to 20,000. And he was on 40,000 at this point, I think. 40,000 health. So we did 15,000 to him in a cycle. So I think calculation's correct. We've killed him. Yeah, nothing he can do with the counters as well. Okay, we'll speed up. We'll speed up to see if we kill him. Oh, I didn't even realize there was... We're on turn 16 out of 20 with Anklos Luck. So at 20... What happens? Does the battle just end? It's like, oh, there you go. You survived. Well done. <laughs> Luckily, we are just about to finish this. And Anklos looks. He does 360 damage. And because he got that lucky crit on me, when I could take damage, I would have died. I could not take another cycle. Like, next turn would have killed me. One more turn. So that was so close. And all that for just 30 Freaking DNA. And to taunt me, just to taunt me, the next one is double. And it's 60. And it's against stupidly ridiculous dinosaurs. <laughs> Which also boosts on. What, what's my team? A tiny, tiny Anklos looks. And the thing is, Ankloceratops is a perfect counter because it can do bleed and get rid of your shield. The, uh, the Anorcritix, or whatever it is, straight away, can go for a Devour Wound, straight through any shield. Uh, yeah. I mean, if I really pushed it, maybe I could kill one or two. A boss T-Rex. Ah, oh, it would be so cool to get up to that point, but what's his moves? Everything, everything is to counter Anklos Lux. All your team is all about shields and healing. And he goes for everything. Every, like, it goes through block, and it goes through shield, it goes through armor. They know what they were doing when they made that. They knew what they were doing. Anyway, let's have a look. You waited here long enough. Clever girl. And does it look any different to a normal raptor? No. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? You just reskinned the raptor? You just put another color on it? No, they could have so easily have made it look like the big one, like the model, the 1993 model. Universal has that model. Just ask for that or even remodel the raptor. Oh, that's such a shame. Because with Rexy, they actually changed the model so it looks like Rexy. That's Rexy. They ch it's not the T-Rex, it's Rexy. But for some odd reason, for this guy, they were like, no, no, no. We're just going to use exactly the same model. I mean, we can compare. Okay, put them side by side. Are they the same raptor? And you can't tell me. Oh, were they based off the Jurassic Park raptors? I think they look exactly the same. The The model itself is the same. The, the color's different. They put a different skin map or color map on it. But it's pretty much the same, which is such a shame because... Anyway, guys, that was the event. I, I kind of expected to get that far, if I'm going to be honest. When I saw that Brachiosaur boss, or sorry, the blue boss, I thought, oh, I see how it is. I see how it is, Lydia. <laughs> but anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, where we'll cover more Jurassic World alive things or, I don't know, whatever else you decide to watch on the channel. I'll see you guys later. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs>